Kurt, all in all, uh, tied for fifth place in the North Division when it's all said and done. Just how do you assess this inaugural season? Uh, well, all th I think all things considered, I mean, uh, we're disappointed in, in, in the losing, for sure. Would have liked to have won more games. Uh, throw that out. Um, I thought there was a lot of development, and it wasn't just our young players that developed. I thought that we saw a lot of growth in our older players. I mean, two examples that I've been using is, and not to slight anybody, but I thought Patrick Seeloff had tremendous growth as a hockey player, and I think as an organization, uh, I think we have a better understanding of what we have in Patrick. And same thing with Eric Bergdorfer. I mean, there's an older player, more of a veteran player, um, that I've seen a lot of growth in. So I think that's the one thing that we're going to want to hang on to. I mean, we're going to let the losing go. Uh, I don't want to deflect at the end of the day. I don't want to make excuses for the losses. But, you know, we did have a tremendous amount of injuries. We had plenty of call-ups within the organization. And I think that made it a little bit difficult on us. But all in, the guys were wonderful. They never stopped working. Their attitudes were great. And um, it was an adjustment to Belleville, but I think what I'm hearing is everybody absolutely loves Belleville. So I think this is going to be a good marriage. Uh, you often called this group a special group. What was it specifically about them that made them that way? Yeah, I, I just think they were good people. You know, I think they were good people. And if you've never been through what we've been through, um, you know, you want to keep things in perspective. It's a sport, and I'm talking about losing. But in our world, it matters. And, uh, and at the end of the day, the guys just continued to show up every day with a good approach, a good attitude, and they just soldiered on. And that's not always easy to do. And I think when you saw them out in the public, when we did our appearances, when we went to schools, when we did some of the other functions around town, uh, I don't think anybody would have ever guessed that this was a group of guys that weren't having success because they carried themselves so well. Uh, for you personally, how much of an honor has it been to be the inaugural head coach of the Belleville Senators? Yeah, it's, you know, I, I, I love my relationship with the Ottawa Senators, number one, and I have known that we were going to be here in Belleville for quite some time, and I've had a chance to get a little bit of a feel for the community. And the one thing that I did learn, and one thing we don't even have to let go, is the fact that the Bulls used to be Belleville's team. And um, you know what? What I'm finding is that people still have, a place in their heart for the Bulls, but they're really growing to appreciate the Belleville Senators, and um, I think that's something that moving forward is going to be a lot of fun for everybody. But personally, um, it's been a lot of fun because you know there will only be one inaugural coach here in Belleville, and I get to be that guy, and and uh, and it means a lot to me. So it's it's something that hopefully we'll be able to grow off of. Um, but what a great little community this is. Kurt, thank you as always for the time. It's much appreciated. All right, thank you, Matt.